Right, still on the same Zimbabwe crisis, and tension and uncertainty remain high in Harare after the military takeover. And it not appears to be a seal of the fate of uh, Robert Mugabe, fired Vice President Emerson Mnagwanga, is now back in the country uh, from South Africa to take charge of the government. Meanwhile, Mugabe remains under house arrest in the capital, Harare, with world leaders calling for calm, even as the era of the 93-year-old comes to an end. The United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres is now appealing for calm and restraint. British Prime Minister Theresa May called on all sides to show restraint too. Uh, a little bit confusing right now, and we're trying to get the details on this. Uh, the Secretary General has been monitoring the evolving situation in Zimbabwe. He appeals for calm, nonviolence, and restraint. Preservation of fundamental rights, including freedom of speech and assembly, is of vital importance. The Secretary General stresses the importance of resolving political differences through peaceful means and dialogue and in line with the country's constitution. In this context, he notes the efforts of the Southern African Development Community.